This is Christian Ackerman with Fast Coast Productions. I just recently bought a 2018 Mac Mini, which you can kind of see right there. It's working right now. I'm exporting a video that was actually um, shot in 4K. 3840, 2160, 4K video is what I've been editing on here. And I found that while previewing like multiple layers, um, doing like titles and stuff like that, it would start to choke and like um, freeze up a little bit, but it would continue playing, but it would freeze up. So then what I ended up doing was I did the, I transcode um, the media into proxy media by highlighting all the video and then right clicking and say transcode. And I just checked proxy media. And then I was able to turn to my viewer as just proxy media form and been able to edit like no problem and watch things no problem stop play and then if I needed to check on the monitor because it does play it at a lower resolution if I needed to check the monitor on monitor uh, the quality of the video if I did like a zoom in or whatnot I could um, flip back over to the optimized original footage and see the quality and make sure everything looked okay um, and what we did with this 4K footage is we put it in a 1080p, uh, we put it in a 1080p timeline, and then that's so when I brought in the 4K footage, I can go in and push into it. Uh, you get about four quadrants of, um, zoom basically before it starts to really pixelate. So I was able to do that on this video and it's turned out really well and I'm very happy with it, but then I can flip between proxy media and the original content by just a click of a button and um, it really worked out very well so I've had no problems and this is again the I got the bottom of the line 2018 Mac mini it's it's just the you know the basic one the the cheapest one you can get and it's working out great and I am thinking about upgrading my graphics situation my graphics card by getting an external GPU later on so once that kind of happens, I'll talk more about this. I'm also really thinking about getting the next one up and um, kind of get souped up for my needs. And then I can do something to uh, talk about that video. But right now, for those editors out there who are going from like a 2014 Mac Mini or like a slower uh, you know, desktop a Mac computer, or maybe you're just getting into a Mac, uh, these are really good. They're a good start and they're, I'm doing professional work on them and it's working out really great with what I'm doing. So far, I, what I do is I work with Final Cut Pro and it works out fine. Um, again, I will do another video where I talk about uh, HitFilm Express. I did a little DaVinci Resolve. It, it actually works pretty well. It does kind of still choke a little bit. You do have to do that low resolution playback on it. but with just HD 1080p stuff, it works really well in DaVinci Resolve. So I'll talk about those other softwares later on, but so far, basically, what you can take home from this is the Mac Mini is rocking right now with the um, 4K footage of uh, 3840, 2160 pixels, and then turned into proxy media, so you can edit at a nice, smooth, um, fast rate, which is really cool, and it's just optimal for when you're editing. Um, I really highly recommend it. And I'm also, um, th this project I'm working on, I'm editing not on a solid state drive, I'm editing actually on just a regular hard drive. I got the Lacey, um, two terabyte hard drive, 135 megabytes per second. Um, it's a USB-C model, also comes with the regular uh, USB connector, connection. And it um, it's sitting back here working, and this is where I have the product on here, just because um, it just that that's what works for me when I'm editing. Um, and it's working out really good. I'm really loving this right now. And it's just two terabytes. I do have a um, solid state drive that expands all my storage space on this uh, computer. I got a one terabyte solid state um, that works really well. And then I plan to get more and maybe uh, bigger storage later on. But this is what I'm using with my Mac Mini and it's working fine, everything's fine. Um, and using uh, solid state actually is really, really great. And then I'll probably do another video about just Final Cut itself and editing with it with the new Mac Mini 2018 uh, model um, because there are some things I ran into that I figured out how to fix, but I still don't understand why. I have an idea why, 
but I don't understand why, and I'll talk about that later in another video. But there you guys go. The 2018 model with 4K footage so far is awesome, especially if you put it in proxy mode. So I'm really liking it. My name is Christian Ackerman with Fast Coast Productions. If you want to find out more things that I work on and projects we do, go to fastcoastproductions.com. Please like and subscribe. Hit that bell notification button because I'm always doing things every once in a while, either once a week or sometimes once a day. Um, I have videos kind of coming out randomly, so um, be sure to hit that bell notification. You'll know or be the first to see my videos. Guys, thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later, and hopefully... I'll see you in the movies.